Tonight, an alleged sexual predator could face hundreds of years behind bars. This after police say he violently attacked seven women in the valley. Team 12's Adriana Loya talking to those who knew the suspect. And we do want to warn you that this story contains some graphic details. 25-year-old Tyler Mungia is accused of brutally sexually assaulting, kidnapping, and torturing seven women across the valley over eight months. This 23-page indictment against him, disturbing. These are violent attacks, violent attacks that do not have any place in our society today. It was in this Chandler home near Loop 101 and Ray Road, where police say seven women were violently attacked by Tyler Mungia. But we always like thought something was kind of off. According to court documents, the 25-year-old suspect kidnapped the victims at knife point across Phoenix and Chandler. He would force them into his car, bound their arms, legs, and mouths with duct tape, even placing a bag over their heads. Investigators say he sexually assaulted the women in his car, took them to his Chandler home, and continued the brutal attack there. The assault spanning eight months from October 2021 until a day before he was arrested last June. It's just shocking, you know. Chase Thud grew up knowing the suspect. Did you ever think he was capable of something like that? No, you know, I don't think any of us ever like expected that. Chase seeing Mungia a week before his arrest. Driving the car, police allege some of the crimes happened in. There was like like girls' underwear and stuff in there, like like a thong and stuff, other stuff like that. And I was like, dude, what is this doing in your car? He's like, oh, it's my girlfriend's. And like he was actually like supposed to get married too. Chase remembers Mungia telling him he wanted to be a youth pastor. This was a case that took hours and hours and took us across the country. Uh, to be able to locate victims. Court documents say Mungia filmed his attacks. Through video, they were able to identify six of the seven women. They described the seventh as a white or Hispanic 18 to 22 year old. She was seen wearing these two necklaces, one with the word angel. This guy uh, committed a lot of violent um, acts. Um, so having him in prison right now or behind bars um, is absolutely a, um, a help to the community. If you have any information regarding the remaining woman, you're asked to call 480-WITNESS. In Phoenix, Adriana Loya, 12 News.